A documentary called Skulls of My People about the Namibian genocide was shot and broadcasted by Al Jazeera recently and really brought home the reality of what the Nama and Herero endured under German rule. You give to our people! No. You massacre them! No. You hang them! No. You hang them! No. You hang them! No. No. We asked the German ambassador, Christian Schlager, for an update on negotiations with his government. We still aim at finding a common wording for the historic events of the years 1904 to 1907, for which Germany is ready to explain and uh, declare an apology. But we need to talk about the details, which will be done during those talks. And then as a final step, we will also talk uh, about what the German special envoy always calls um, measures to heal the wounds, which according to his own statements also often made in public, could, but not necessarily must, but could cover um, a fund for reconciliation projects as well as specific support measures from Germany to facilitate and to improve uh, the life of the specifically and particularly affected communities in the various areas. As a direct descendant of the Ovaherero, politician Kadenambo Kadenambo is passionate about this issue and we asked him about his view on how government has handled it. The Namibian government and the German government want to relegate, want to relegate the Ovaherero and Nama genocide to bilateral relationship, to a relationship based on state actors. It's wrong. Under the United Nations Convention, it doesn't read that the genocide of Namibia, it is clearly stipulated that it's of a Herero Nama genocide. The Namibian government is distorting that history, it's coming up with a different issue of Namibian genocide. It's not a Namibian genocide, it's a lie. If you deny it and play it down, how do you expect me to move with, together with you in, in a reconciled manner? How do I become part of the, of the, of the so-called Namibian house? Kadenambo feels that government stance will incite disunity amongst the country's citizens. It's about time that we pass a law in this country where people will, know, will not deny about the genocide, the Obahero and Nama genocide, where people will not deny about the Kasinga massacre, where people will not deny about the Oshikuku massacre, where people will not deny about Kufut running over Omahangu fields. Because this thing is part of us, it's part of our being. It's our history, it's where we come from. <laughs>